A few months ago, I did a video based on how tall Fury was. Looking back on it, using the baby baboon head was not the best idea as heads are often exaggerated in cartoons for kids pleasure. This means that the result really doesn't give an accurate enough value for Fury's height. I then discovered that funnily enough, in the lion guard there are lots of larger animals such as hippos, zebras, rhinos, lions and elephants. Comparing Fury with them would get a far better result for her height. I decided early on to take an array of animals who are standing close to Fury and take their average height, before comparing Fury with each of them to get a result. The average value for Fury's height from these calculations will give the final accepted value. The first image is this one showing the lion guard from above. We can overlay a picture of Bassey, the leader of the hippo float and an image showing how large adult hippopotamuses are onto of this image assuming Bassey is indeed a fully grown hippo. This image also has Besht in it as well which means we can make the two Beshts the same length. We can then place a side on drawing of Fury above the plan view shot and move it to the height chart in the hippo scale image. Looking at the image and doing a few calculations we see that full is around 130.5 cm in this image. The next 5 calculations will all have the same basic ideas behind them so if you want to watch one and skip to the conclusion then that's fine. Now this is an image of extracted from the Mbali fields migration. This is a great image as it shows Fury right next to a zebra. This means I do not necessarily need to do any editing to the image to get them lined up. How non-foolish. Instead I can just draw some lines that represent 130 centimeters. The distance of this is 518 pixels. We can divide this by 130 meaning each centimeter is represented by 4 pixels. We can divide Fury's 498 pixels by 4. This means Fury's height must be around 124.5 centimeters. Brilliant. Where do we go from here? This image shows Fury in my own way close to some elephants. I'm going to do the height comparison with the first elephant as he is clearly the most senior and so will be close in size with an adult African elephant at 330 centimeters. This picture luckily shows Fury around level with the elephant in terms of distance. This means we can simply compare the two as they are. The elephant is 760 pixels for 330 centimeters meaning each centimeter is represented by 2.3 pixels. This brings Fuel's height to 170.9 centimeters. Oh bother. This can't be right. A possible solution from this is that these are actually forest elephants not bush elephants. Forest elephants are smaller at around 275 centimeters tall. This means the 760 pixels here represents that and so each pixel is actually represented by 2.8 centimeters. This brings Fury's 381 pixels to around 136.1 centimeters. Much more reasonable. Here is a screenshot in Ono the Tickbird. It shows Fury next to Kifaru the Rhino. Now adult rhinos are around 1.8 meters tall. This picture shows Fury and Kifaru. However his front is exaggerated through perspective. We can however move Fury to the rear end of Kifaru. This shows us that Fury comes up to around a half a spot down of this spot. Great, where do we go next? This image shows Kifari in a much better angle. This means we can retain the point of a half spot down of the same spot and draw a line of imaginary Fury. Kifaru is 720 pixels and 180 centimeters tall. This means we can do 720 divided by 180 to get a nice 4. Fury is 442 pixels tall here which brings her height in this picture to 110.5 centimeters. Also notice how Kyan is way too small here. How foolish. This foolish image shows Fury confronting Jassery. Hyenas are 7091.5 cm at the shoulder so we are going to take the lower bound from this as Jassery is young and bent at an angle a bit. Fury is also bending down but luckily I can overlay this image I found earlier. Now Jassery's shoulder is 262 pixels which is 70 cm. This means every 3.7 cm represents a pixel. We can therefore calculate that Fury's 472 pixels is 127.6 cm high. This final image shows Fury and Simba standing opposite each other, giving a good comparison. This means I can quite easily overlay the two. Simba is an adult male lion, which are around 1.2 meters tall at the shoulder. This means we can draw a line at 1.2 meters and at the top of Fury's head. 
Simba's shoulder is 384 pixels high and 120 centimeters high. This shows us each centimeter is represented by 3.2 pixels. This means Fury's 440 pixels equates to 137.5 centimeters. So in conclusion we can finally take the average from these six values and give a safe and reasonable average of Fury's height. The final value we can safely assume is 127.78 centimeters. This is quite a bit larger than the 95.4 centimeters I calculated last time. Here is an image of Fury's dimensions based off her height. Here is an image of how tall she is when standing straight. And here is an image of her fully stretched out. This means that Fury is quite a bit larger for what a cheat of her age should be with a large neck, head and tail. Further reinforcing my opinion that Fury is a super cheater, or not really a cheater at all. I mean, look at her spots.